All right, so just remember, guys, when we're given a table of values, but in this case, what they're asking us to do in the first one is, again, times, find uh, f times g of negative 2. Sorry. f times g. What am I doing? f of g of negative 2. So the first important thing, though, we know is we have to multiply our functions because it's saying find the derivative of f times g of negative 2. So therefore, the first thing we want to do is at least go ahead and apply the um, chain rule. So f prime of uh, x times g of x plus f of x times g prime of x. And then obviously, guys, we're just trying to evaluate for f prime of negative 2, g of negative 2 plus f of negative 2 times g prime of negative 2. And obviously, we can skip around a little bit on the couple of steps on this one, right? But in case, but now we can just go to our table and find f prime of negative 2, which is negative 1. g of negative 2, so we've got a g of x of negative 2 is 4. Plus f of negative 2, doo -doo -doo -doo, f of negative 2, which is 5. And g prime of negative 2, which is g prime of negative 2, which is 1. So we have negative 4 plus 5, which equals a positive 1. All right? Good. Um, so therefore, on the quotient rule, guys, it's just going to be the exact same thing. 